Hello and welcome to Fierce Competition, a Thief 2 20th Anniversary Contest Mission by JRoot. Now this doesn't have a uh, briefing, so I'm going to read it out. I've recently been contacted by a local businessman who is having some trouble with one of his competitors. From what he's told me, it seems like he wants me to find out information about his business to get a competitive edge. I've agreed to take the job, and the client has told me he'll leave detailed instructions by his house on the night. It's getting dark. Looks like it's time to leave. Alright, probably going hard as usual. Let's uh, see what the objective's like. While you're out there, you should pick up some loot. 1500 should be enough. Your client lives on the upper level of the north side of the quarter. Find out what he wants you to do. A thief shouldn't leave any evidence behind. Don't kill anybody. Once you're done, leave the way you came. Oh, Expert has don't kill anybody, but also has a bonus objective. You've heard rumours of a minor lord in the area having a pagan relic in his possession. Steal it. Uh, hang on. Normal is blah. Hard already has don't kill anybody. So Expert is not. It's adding more loot. Um, but, you know, my usual reason for choosing hard is because it lets me... Uh, uh, kill guards when times get tough, which, you know, happens sometimes. If you've watched my videos, you'll know. But since Hard here already has a don't kill anybody objective, then I'm not losing that if I go up to Expert, and I am getting an optional objective, which, uh, which I think I want to do. Other uh, puts a loot go up as well. It'd be it'd be it'd be an interesting thing to try to do in a thief mission. I don't think you could do it through the UI here. Um, but to have different dimensions of difficulty, so you could choose like uh, more optional objectives or more loot or more like mechanical difficulty of like the don't kill anybody, don't knock anybody out, don't get seen kind of thing. Um, the previous mission I just did, Feast of Pilgrims, no, that's the last but one, uh, had a bunch of optional objectives you could get for free in the shop at the start, which is an interesting way of doing that. They were still option marked as optional, which is... You didn't find out about them at all, but if you bought the thing, they became visible and optional. But anyway, let us begin. That's, that's not relevant to this mission. First competition, let's go... Find out what our client wants us to do. I mean, that's a quite an open-ended kind of thing. Let's check what I've got. This is wasn't a shop. Sword, blackjack, eight broadheads, four waters, one fire arrow. Oh, wow. Two musk arrows. One rope arrow, so I better be careful with that. Compass, one flash bomb, lockpicks, one healing potion. All right. Oh, there's a downside of... The other downside of expert is look at my... Uh, Health is, of course, very limited. Ooh, twisting stair. Anything nice open window there? That's highly tempting. Ah, hello, I see you there. Trying to hide. These mechanists never clean their machinery uh, well enough. Look, water crystals form everywhere. I think it's all going to clean itself. Probably. Hammerite should never be so careless. Uh, well, that's no good. That's no good at all. Do I take that loss or do I reload? I didn't break it. In theory, I should be able to get up there somehow, some other way. Oh, there's wood up here. Oh, I'm gonna reload that and, and go up through these and onto the pipe. Okay. Um, I'm not, uh, not 
world's greatest start is uh, seeing the wooden beam and not seeing the obstrude the protruding pipe, <laughs> which would uh, kind of make the rope stop. What's in here? Uh, actually, what does it say? Collect the job instructions from the client. Do we have a map? We do have a map. Start here. Our client's at the north. So, well, that's not a very big city. Um, so, we're kind of... Okay. Right north, yeah. So, we're going west now. Good. We're up in, going up in here. So, it's not very far to the client. So, I guess I'll check out what's in here and then... Then make your way to the client. Hello. There's a door there that might be able to get into as well. <sighs> Can't see a thing. Oh, hello. Take the out. Leading on doors. There's no guards up here, so I definitely wouldn't have been able to get in here a different way. Fruit, apple, nice. Do I chop down the banner? Do I chop down the banner? You know, up until now, I've always operated on the uh, principle of, oh, hello, what's this? Of all banners must die. But, um, when playing Feast of Pilgrims, a banner saved my life on, I think, three separate occasions. You know, that maybe they're not all evil. Hello, is that a... in the fireplace? It sounds like it's in the fireplace. Maybe it's behind the banner. You know what? I apologize, banner. I, you did nothing to me. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, it's just a way into the chimney. Or behind the chimney. Oh, I guess it is the chimney. <laughs> Alright, so we're going in the up further north as a starting point. <laughs> Some old attic. With, uh, Well, you know what? This rooftop will make a very, very good way to get to our clients without being, uh, hopefully, without being spotted or alerting any guards on the street below, as long as we can avoid clanking. Dear Top Ops Corp, dear customer, thank you for choosing to place your order with us. We hope you found our service satisfactory. Below you will find your invoice. Item, wooden cheese prop, quantity 100. Total cost, 3,000 gold. Why would you want 100 wooden cheese props? Footsteps put us outside. Thankfully, I don't need to know. Where would that window go? Oh, I guess it goes out here. Yeah. That's not a door. Is there anything suspicious about this fireplace apart from he's burning cheese with it? It doesn't look it. I don't think I want to waste a water hour to find out. Uh, keep going north. Well, why not? There's a window here. It works. It's just, it's just our client's place. I think we're just above them. Oh, hello. 
Garrett. My bitter business rival, Lord Thorak, has recently found a new supplier with lower costs than my own, and has been undercutting my pricing. Tonight, your task is to find out who it is, along with any other business-related information you can find. Thorak is also an anim amateur astronomer, and I've heard he's planning to present some findings at a conference soon. If you can find and remove his research so that he has nothing to present, it would be a big blow to his reputation. I know from previous visits that his observatory is in the South Wing. Additionally, anything else you can find that can be used against him would be a great help. I will be expecting to see you again in a few days. You will get your payment then, providing, of course, you are successful. Steal Lord Thorax Business Ledger. Steal Lord Thorax Astronomy Research. Uh, bonus objective, find the rumoured pagan relic. And find something that can be used to besmirch the Thorax family name. Bismarch. Such a good word. Well, now we know what we have to do. Thorax is on the west. So let's let's go back and uh, explore these rooftops on the eastern side here for uh, valuables. Lord Frederick, I recently finished the appraisal of the doll you asked me about. I understand that it is a family heirloom, so I'm sure you're expecting it to be worth a lot. Lucky for you, you are correct. Your family heirloom is, in fact, a rare pagan artifact. Artifacts like these are very popular with collectors and are guaranteed to sell well. I can offer you 1,500 gold now to take it off your hands so that you don't have to worry about managing the sale yourself. Let me know if you are still interested in pursuing this. A doll. It's a rare pagan artifact. I think we all know. What was that? Nothing there. Nothing there. <laughs> oh, there's a guard patrol there, all right. I think we all know which doll that is. Ah, uh, these make a fanatic in the metal floors. Is six o'clock now. I don't think I've ever noticed the gears moving in uh, these clocks before. Interesting. Guess it has some tweaks I didn't know about. Wait, is this Lord Fredericks? Yes. The doll must be in here somewhere, surely. The rumored pagan relic, this has got to be the right place for it, right? Get off. Unless that was a letter. No, this is Lord Frederick, so this is a letter written to him. Uh, unsigned. Oh, hello. This looks hazardous, but probably worth a shot. As in getting down from here will be hazardous. Getting up is already hazardous. Uh, getting down is doable without death. That's that's good news. Let's try again so I can actually see on top of the rafters. Although I, I think there's nothing there. Yeah, there's nothing there. Pity, but all right. Did you have a secret room behind one of these wardrobes or anything? Hmm. 
And that's quite firmly a non-door, right? Yep. How this painting is hide a safe. It would be a strange place for a safe. But it could be. Maybe he doesn't keep it in his house. I mean, his house is very small. I should say, what's that? It's the foot of the bed. How about this wardrobe? Anything suspicious about it? Doesn't appear to be. I can't mess with the clock, so... Uh, um, baffling. <laughs> Not very brightly lit there. Any idle guard wondering why would probably not be able to avoid seeing us. <laughs> well, we'll have to come back then. Yeah, nobody. That's not not what I meant to do. I mean, obviously, it was not what I meant to do. It's more like it. Don't scare me like that, Benny. We've got here a key and a note and a ring. Tavern room key. Fred, this past year you've changed. All your time is been trying to improve your reputation and popularity with Lord Thurrock instead of with our daughter. All our money is spent on parties and other such needless things. Your recent decision to spend a year's income redecorating the entire house in a mechanist style was the last straw. As I've said many times, we cannot afford these expenditures, and you're putting our daughter at risk. This isn't a healthy environment to raise Lucian. You've done nothing to fix things, so I've decided we needed some time away. I'll be travelling to my parents shortly. Your wife, Elizabeth. P.S. Lucy wouldn't leave the doll behind, so I've taken it with us for now, but I promise to return it when I can. Aha. That explains why... why the doll... was not in uh, Lord Frederick's... house. What are these rooms? Wow. Toilets on the upper floor in this uh, fancy tavern. Is this Lucy's room? Maybe? Somebody's sleeping here. Does not look like a Lucy. I think I'll leave them to their rest. Perhaps they're downstairs at the tavern. Well, there's certainly people about. Hello. There's two floors. Or is this to a basement? Seems basementy. Very basementy. Let's check it out first. Kitchen. Oh, hello. Someone's got some good wine up there among all the uh, common stuff. Is that wooden cheese? No, that looks like actual cheese. Collect all the food. Always check the sinks, you know. People are careless with their uh, gold dishes. And their gold cups. Hello. I'm going to leave that open, it'll be a useful uh, indicator when I come back, or when I'm out there, as to 
connections and possible escape routes. Escape routes are important. Hmm. Please don't play games. That was rather a waste. I've still got two left though, so you know. Don't mind me, sir. I'm not gonna reload just for a small waste of water arrows. I can I can make do, I think. Sorry to have disturbed you folks, you should really sit down and get back to your, uh, whatever it is. Well, <clears throat> it's kind of wasteful because there wasn't much here, you know. I'm a very drunk guard. So I guess the basement window is down there. Um, right, we're here. That's the tavern. There's a window. There's a window here I need to remember to check out. Unfortunate, tried to mantle and hopped in. So let's let's go back to the rooftop to see if there's a way to progress up there first. <laughs> oh, the card across the way would definitely see me if he looked. Yeah, he saw me. It's an archer too. Although... Thankfully didn't get too... alerted. Where am I even going from here? This is not good. I don't have a plan. Uh, hmm. Let's go back to Interlord Freds. <laughs> Come on, Garrett, you can jump onto a simple desk, can't you? I know there's a guard that does patrol up here, so I need to be a little more careful than I have been earlier. This one. Let's, uh... So there's other footsteps. Were they down there, or were they in through here? Guess we can find out. Top is interesting. As is that balcony. <laughs> Hello, what do I see there? Somebody left some money in a safe place. A very safe place. Where does this go patrol to? So I guess he goes down there and then turns around. Hmm. Yeah. Wonder what that noise was. 
Mmm, sounded kind of like an arrow sticking into wood. Can I go straight onto the road from here? I can. Good. Bakery. That's not my other lock brick. That would be uh, quite unfortunate. It's just like somebody starts spamming flash bombs by mistake when you wanted to use a lock brick. All right, well, let's make sure we don't walk into this guy's face. So we're here, I guess. All right. Guards everywhere. It's very busy. Oh, have I been up there? I don't think I have. How do I get up there? If I was up there again, there's a pipe. Well, I guess I know where I'm going then. See, he... he's going back and forth. He's not stuck, he's just going back and forth in the most aggravating fashion. All right. Oh, he goes, no, I was gonna say he goes inside. No, he opens the door sometimes. Who goes there? Okay, calm down. There's nothing there. There's never anything there. Yeah, thankfully moss still uh, works and it does but less thankfully this roof tried to kill me <sighs> and the archer's watching who's that there nobody don't know what you're looking at Bollocks. Just rats again. I calm down very quickly. That's <laughs> kind of nice. All right, let's try this again. Oh, this ledge was—I couldn't jump. I was trying to jump a mantle, and that sticky up it was getting in the way. That's unfortunate. All right, so that's the windows up there I was looking at, but that's not. I need to remember to check them out. Oh, hello. There's a guard inside this place. And he's on me. Let's come back, shall we? Oh, hello. Let's see if I can get a rope in there. Another rope arrow, or 
to. Hello, dead rat. Not bad now. Hmm. Do I cut it down? You know, banners can be your friends sometimes. But sometimes even your friends have to die. Well, for nothing. Sorry, banner. Oh, hello. Alright, nothing else up here, I think. Actually, we're going to be worse than just dropping down, I think. Alrighty. Let's see if we can get in here without speaking the guard this time. And we can certainly continue on. to the south. Oh, we... Oh, is this Lord Thorax already? Okay. No. Maybe? Yeah, we just went in there. That's built out. So this is... That looks out on his, on his balcony then. Alright, so this is where we got to do the job. Um, Alright. Come in here. I think you know Lord Dark's men. What was that? No. Deserve a break. Deserve a rest. After all, our client didn't insist that we did the, do this undetectably. He obviously wants Lord Dark. Thorak? Thorak. Thorak. Obviously, he wants Lord Thorak to know who did it. I mean, why attack your rivals if you if you want to pretend you had nothing to do with it? Although I guess he'd pretend to have nothing to do with it while making sure he knew absolutely but could not prove it. Do I dare jump before the carpet? No. My carpet jumping skills are weirdly broken. I mean, I always think I can make it and I either undershoot or overshoot and go clattering on the tile and I'll let every guard for three miles around. It's not a pretty sight. I guess that's Lord Thorak's bedroom, perhaps? Speed potion. To see if there's a good place to use that for a flying loop. Another interior toilet with a lid, wow. Well, that'll keep the smell out. This Lord Thorak is a wealthy... wealthy person. Toilet lids are... Uh, Highly expensive. Should we got Sus Balcony? Yes. And that's the window is that we saw at yeah, the entryway.
Where am I hearing that person? I mean, it sounded like they were right here. But clearly not. Hello, what's that? Big lever for that city gate. Okay, that's away to the east. That's here, I guess. All right, enough looking to you, Garrett. You've got a job to do. Ah, oh, we're gonna need a key. I put the fire out so this would be a nice safe room, but uh, well, I'm short on water arrows for no particular reason. I always forget to listen to the, listen to the door before opening it, and it's almost always a good idea. Unless you're pretty sure that it's just like a bathroom. Even then, you know, you could be walking in on someone in the bath, and uh, they would probably scream, Look, another toilet lid! No exp expense spared. They would probably scream, and that would probably bring the guards running, and... Uh, Sometimes that ends with little drops of red stuff falling out of Garrett's body before Garrett's body falls. Oh, look at that fancy ceiling, these filthy rich nobles. Marble ceiling. It's just decadence. They must be downstairs. Doesn't sound like they're coming up here though. But it does sound like they're walking down this hallway in front of me. Indeed they are. Back to our corner, because I believe that guard enters that room. Well, he probably doesn't come all the way in here. I want to follow this other one to the left, I think. Yeah, there's footsteps on the carpet. He's coming. I mean, quietly. It's the downside of the carpet. It's good for me, but it's harder to hear when guards are approaching. And he's not even muttering to himself very much. One tiny, tiny tap on the floor. Just you rats. Make one mistake. Yeah, well, I already did. Or you, if I hadn't, you wouldn't have heard me. There's nothing here. Uh, not this time. Right, now the door's shut. I should, uh... Oh, look, I made it. Okay, so he goes. So he's. Uh, I was going to say he goes in that room, and so I can go to this one. But no, it's the same room, and he was going around in a circle. And 
there's someone else in here. Ah, oh, asleep. Alright. Oh. There's a guard. Downstairs? Staying downstairs? There's a stairway there. Casting houses. All right. I don't really have a good body disposal spot except in the upstairs bedroom. So you know what? Let's go to the upstairs bedrooms. Should be a nice short diversion. Careful about jumping with bodies, Garrett. You know you can't jump very far. Well, for all this guy's fancy house, uh, it's not very well soundproof. Like those footsteps of guards just like reverberate. All right, you'll be nice and safe there. I'm tempting fate with all this jumping under carpet, you know, especially with the how well sound carries in this house. Fate is such a temptress. It's a very nice, very nice little uh, spiral staircase here. Deep sleeper. Well, she just stayed quiet. I can't pick up. But I think it means God is probably going to be here soon. I see that book, I see that book. I didn't expect it to be opening right behind me, that's uh... Ah, there's other... Oh, there's the guard. Stay awake! I think there is something going on. He's asleep. And he's not a guard, he's your boss. Careful, there's something up. Watch for anything unusual. Well, we got uh, a fair evidence. Can't read it, but it will let us do the besmirching. The besmirchery? Did you just leave the door open? You could be fired for that, you know. Doesn't have any money on him to. Alright, back upstairs. I think the guard might have heard the screams and been slightly spooked. Which is why you're saying be careful, you know, look out for anything because it's suspicious. <clears throat> oh, 
Well, this is a grand entrance room. Where's the guard? I wonder where he goes after that. Does he come around to these stairs? Can't read that from here. Obviously connects to that passage. Yep, he's coming there. Good thing I didn't just run out. Job. I don't always nobles with all this spare furniture. I mean, imagine that luxury. Put spare furniture the carrot gets stuck on. else in here is there? Oh yes, hello. Nice tapestry or something. Something that will bring a smile to my fence's face. That's a lie, he never smiles. Oh, the observatory. Research is hopefully here, ready to be taken, as well as some other valuables. Forgive me, Banner. Your death was in vain. Yours too, probably. Yep. Hmm. If you were an astronomer, where would you hide your research? <gasps> well, Garrett knows nothing about astronomy, so he can't really answer the question. Steeler's astronomy research. There was a note saying the observatory was in the south wing, which is where we are. But perhaps he prefers merely to do observations here. And not... Oh. And not actually stories research, unless he only has books full of drawings of stars. He's just painted every page black and then scratched little white dots on it. How boring. Alright, I wanna get a picture of this room. <laughs> So I might use that for the screenshot. I don't know. Is there someone on the balcony or the street below? Oh, that's the archer out the front. He just paces back and forth, back and forth. Very boring life you must have. Hopefully he's getting paid enough. Right, so we could get out in here. Although I don't know about getting down safely. There was a tower there with a wooden beam. I wonder what's up, up there. Could I... Let's try it. No, let's try it. Stand here, though. I'm 
it's a very thin metal box. Hello. <laughs> Let's hope I don't need the rope. Study key. Oh, this is also part of Lord Darax. Alright, we've got his ledger, we've got his accounts. I think that's everything we need to steal from him, yeah. Well, apart from money. We've done our client's job, now we've got our job to do. Alright, I was up here before, was I? Yes, and I couldn't open it. Well, let him let him think he just left his study carelessly unlocked, as well as the rest of his house, and his guards carelessly unconscious. Actually, let's blame the guard for the theft. I mean, not that he'll think that the guard actually did it, I suppose, but uh, guards there, well, you know what? What's he doing in there, sleeping? Suspicious, you know, suspicious. All right, we still haven't finished scouring his house though, so let's keep on doing that. For instance, I haven't been out that way yet. Let alone down to the ground floor. We knocked out this guard, right? Or maybe that is maybe that connects. It probably connects. That's probably the guard who comes and goes there, because I can't hear him. Observatory. I can't hear any guards anymore except the one outside. Muttering to himself. Oh, we have been here. Alright, crown floor. guards left inside, but uh, there's at least one out there. Out there. Quiet, I tell him, and he immediately clumps on the tile. Oh, he's got a basement too, right? Let's leave that for later. Let's finish this floor first. Wonder how dark is it here? Oh, there's a guard. Didn't see me. Well, let's be a little less careless then. Past. Like that. That was like another guard asleep on the job. Oh, you're so heavy, man. I have to take tiny steps to not go clank. I 
to sleep on the toilet. Don't suppose there's anything of value here. Anyone here shoot diamonds? Nope. Oh, there's a guard. That's funny. I shouldn't be, uh, shouldn't be able to reach him through the wall. Hang on. That's suspicious. It's like a whole other half of this room. Is that just the next room? There's another door just nearby. Something strange. Oh yes, it is. Anybody here? Dropping gold in the toilets, you know. Thankfully not, otherwise Garrett would have to reach down to get it, you know, that's not a fun prospect. But it's happened before. Oh, this is the library. Alright, it's not the guard, it's just him. Why is the dining room locked? So now they move. they've still got the uh, good cops out, I think. Keep the guards away from it. Sensible. Very sensible. The thieves away from all this lovely food, too. Mmm, tasty. Well, that's, we have hit our gold goal. Now, we have not found where Lucy went with the doll. That's, that's a problem. Why am I picking this slot? Just to make it look like the guards forgot to lock the door. Oh, another way to the basement. Alright, well, let's take this one. Presumably, it will connect. Is there a guard in the basement? Seriously. Well, I guess the servants that need uh, guarding. Oh, hello. I surrender. Good. Feast tonight. Just taking a nap in the pantry, you know, on the on the shelf. It's like a bunk bed. More roast deer. Wow, they have, they have so much food in this house. So, uh, it's like they're stocking up for a plague or something. Oh, 
Oh, I've got down here. Well, we have some spilled wine and... No, sorry about that. Sorry. I will continue to chop down every banner and I just just apologize to them. Well, let's check this look at my iron. Oh. Break it, Garrett. to meet thy undeserved fate. See now, one of them I didn't chop down and then discovered I had to because that's where the secret passage was. All the rest I've just like chopped down without any reason, without any suspicion. I'm a horrible person. Note to servant. Erin, this affair with the Lord's son has to stop. He is engaged and if you're found out the family's reputation will be damaged. I turned a blind eye at the beginning, expecting it to end shortly, but it has been months now, and it is affecting your work. You're always in the library, leaving messages for him, perhaps. If this doesn't stop, I will have to fire you and inform the Lord. I know you need this job. Hopefully you see sense and end this. Housekeeper Laura. What's the key? Ah, well, we've got the... Don't think we need either of those. I've already been to the study. Oh wait, I'm going back the way I came. I got entirely turned about. Right, so this is the other door. Yep. Yeah. Basement door is sore. And I guess it goes out to the street. Let's let's exit that way, I think. That's on the eastern side, yeah. It'll take us near the city gate. At least if, you know, when you do a, a trap chest, at least, the bedroll is a nice soft thing anyway. It's, it's a friendly trap. And I I'm certainly can't complain about trap chests. I've made too many of my own. All right, so connects. All right, well, I think we're done with uh, Lord Derek's house. So they got all the evidence we need. We've got plenty of loot. We have guards to watch out for. Here, but can't see. Oh, that's the bloody front gate. Hello. Front gate out, isn't it? Yeah. Come and get me. Oh, would you like a flash bomb? To the face. Oh, hang on. That's the stairs key, that's not the cells. I say, can I unlock the cells and lock him in? You know, that would be justice. I can pick the locks, I presume. No, oh, okay. Oh, look, replacements already. Wow, this is, this is remarkably generous with the equipment for such a small level. Where's the stairs key? Where's the 
Where's all the... No, not all the food. Just keys, keys, got keys. There was another guard upstairs, I believe. Aha. Uh -huh. Keys. Lots of keys. Yep. I'm sure I saw one patrolling. What have we got? Stairs. Evidence room. Cells. Oh, the evidence room key is missing. Well, we can open the cells at least. Let's not go back just yet. There's three cells. I guess that's the evidence room. And I think there's three guards here. One of them would be, uh, was patrolling above the gate. One of them watching the cells. And this fellow. They're going to have a lot of explaining to do in the morning. Does he not have a head or something? It's a headless body, okay. Well, that cell will be for the uh, third guard, I think. an office. Captain Rudders, while reorganizing my personal collections recently, it came to my attention that my prized family heirloom was no longer in my possession. As you know, my wife and daughter recently left me. I believe that they took my family heirloom with them when they did so. This is a clear crime, and I would hope that you take this very seriously. I expect to hear back from you shortly, letting me know what action you plan to take to retrieve my belongings. Regards, Lord F. Oh ho, see? Some banners have to die. So uh, it's all for the best, it's all for the best. My two mines. Two more flash bombs. Oh, they're very well equipped here. Oh jeez, hopefully not made of wood. Aha, evidence room. Where is the key? Hmm, before I loot the evidence room, I'm wondering if maybe, I haven't I'm really, Trolling here. Oh, well, they can go sleep in the third cell. What I say, what I was saying before I interrupted myself was, uh, I wonder if maybe through some turn of events we haven't discovered yet, the doll that Lucy had ended up 
as evidence and is in one of those lockers. Which, it's an objective, so you, you know, it would seem to make sense. Um, it would seem to make perfect sense for me to uh, complete my objective. Oh, that one doesn't lock. Okay. But cells. Why am I? Why am I pretending that I'm supreme ghosting? Why am I knocking everybody out? I don't know. I just the whole putting things back where it belongs is is. It's nice. Whoa. Don't want to stand on top of that when you do that. That's, uh, some could get hurt. Uh huh. Oh, we've been here before. Have I been in that? been up there. Yes, I believe so. Maybe? No. Which direction is that? That's east. We are here. We've just come out here. Yeah, that's that's where we've been. So this is the watch. That's the tavern basement. Wait for them to turn around. I haven't been down that way. That should be the stairway back to the start. He's not turning around. He's going down there. All right, that's fine. No, oh, he, he is turning around. <laughs> I can hear more footsteps, is that just the archer? Well, people will think he's drunk on all the wine. That'll do. start briefly because remember this uh, window up here that I meant to go to I don't know exactly which part of this area would trigger me uh, finishing the mission so in case I pick up the door accidentally somewhere I don't want to you know out of the chest there's a possibility of it I don't want the mission ending when I'm not ready for it. it. Doesn't open, does it? Ever disappointed. Ever disappointed. Turn the lights off before you go to sleep, you know? to be disturbed. What? She must have heard something. Hmm. Go back to sleep, ma'am. You need your rest. Alright, that door doesn't open. She doesn't have any more 
gold, so it's just the candlesticks, I think. Nothing it would be terrible to miss out on, but uh, I wanted to make sure that I would not miss out on it. Back we go. So I haven't actually really checked out the ground floor area around here, have I? We've got Mr. Drunk here, but I can deal with him. Ah, uh, bollocks, you're more of a problem. Flash bombs! He's not chasing me. I rather think you have. Well, these are getting a bit messy, but, uh... Oh, he's dancing on the table now. Oh, you can stay in the watch office. I can't be bothered taking you to the cells. Oh, wait. Okay, that's that guard that we were dodging before. Alright, so I think we have done all this. I think we have done all that ground floor, all right. Who goes there? It's a tavern. So this I was gonna say only this part, but I've been there already. Alright. Oh, Let's go back to the tavern. We know that Frederick's is soon to be ex wife, I guess. Uh, we're staying here. In this room. Oh, hello. They did leave the doll here. Look at that. Just, it's not evidence, it's just here. Yeah. Alright. We found you drop. I could have found you drop a very long time ago. But it's all good now. Went to a logical place to look for clues and found better than clues. Alright, so let's just go loot that evidence room and then we're done. You know what? I'm gonna blame him. I'm gonna blame this guy for the evidence room. Come on, guy, you can get out there. Oh, you can't move fast enough, okay, anybody, okay? Where was the door? Ah, oh, maybe we blame both of you for the evidence room. Or we'll lock you in the evidence room, as the case might be. On the floor. Another rope arrow. I don't know what that's evidence of. So, yeah, someone's been that there's been some thief wandering around stealing from windows. Yeah, you'll do in terms of locking locking people away inside. Evidence room key. Which, where was the evidence room key? It was in, in this office, wasn't it?
All right, before we go, let's have a feast. Some fruit. Uh, let's eat a mine. Good, good plan there. Ten deer legs. One apple. Eight loaves of bread. Ten carrots. Oh, carrots hungry. Three pieces of wooden cheese. Strong teeth you got there, Garrett. One cucumber. And that is all. All the food, all right. Then, once all the objectives complete, leave the way we came. Let's go. Mission success. All right. Um, 2,700 out of 3,400, so we missed 700 and something. That's, that's uh, quite a lot, actually, for a small space. It's my usual blind as a batness. I mean, you saw how, much, how long it took me to notice the uh, doll hidden there by the bed. And that was Fierce Competition. Uh, thanks very much for watching, and I hope you'll join me here for the next mission.